Hey guys, welcome to Tarantula Adventures, and today we're doing another top five list. But this time we're going to do the top five dwarf species of tarantulas I can't wait to have in my collection. Alright, so first up we have the Cardiopelma mascata, or the orange flame rump. First discovered by F Fabian Vole in 1999. The carapace is a beautiful copper like color with a black triangle over the eyes. They have been found in the eastern mountains and borders of Oaxaca City in Mexico. Males typically live around six years, while the females can live about 16. They are, and they are a New World Tarantula. Next up, we have the Cyrocosmus elegans, or the Trinidad Dwarf Tarantula, first described by Eugene Simmon in 1889, can be found in Trinidad, Venezuela, and Tobago. They got a beautiful black triangle surrounded by an orange carapace, and I mean, come on, they have, an, they have a heart on their butt. What's not to love and adore about them? Next, we have the Cyrocosmus Lidzi, or the Colombian Dwarf Tarantula, first described by Fabian Vol in 1999. Hey, look at him go, just describing all these tarantulas. They can be found in Colombia. Females live around five to seven years, while males only about two to three. And again, I'm a sucker for that beautiful orange and black coloring and the stripes on this thing make it even more beautiful to me. Next is going to be the Helpopalmus formosmus or the pumpkin patch large. Was known as the Helpopalmus species columbia, first described by Anton Azurer in 1875, can be found in Colombia. And they get that n name from the orange and black coloring on their body. And honestly, the tarantula just is the embodiment of this Halloween for me. So I can't wait to have this one in my collection someday. All right. So the last one on this list, it's a little hard to pronounce for me. So bear with me. But it is the Dolithocotyl diamanthesis or the Brazilian blue dwarf beauty don't worry i will have correct spelling <laughs> with some of the images first described by uh raggio bernetti and uh, taigo da santos in 2009 they can be found in brazil females live roughly 12 to 15 years males only about three they are heavy webbers so that enclosure will be amazingly covered and they look a lot like the GBB, just miniature. I mean, come on, who doesn't love that? Well, I wanna thank you all for watching this top five list. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down at the bottom. And hey, tell me what your favorite dwarf species is down in the comments. Until next time.